What's up, motherfuckers? It's your boy David here. So, in this video, the David is going to take one of his paintings, this painting that I did back in 2018. So, I'm going to take this painting and I'm going to turn it into an NFT, but it's not going to be just a simple NFT because anything can be an NFT, you know, just a picture, whatever, right? So, I'm going to digitally enhance it. I'm going to make all those arms move, wave. And then, you know, like the clouds are going to be moving. Nothing with the sand. Maybe like the guy, well, the guy's too small. I don't know. Maybe I'll have like the the wave, I mean, uh, the cape waving. But overall, I want to turn this into a Jeff. Uh, I pronounce Jeff. If you have a problem with it, you can go f*** yourself, whatever. I don't work out at no gym, okay? It's not going to be as cool as the actual painting, but we're going to make this 3D. And so first of all, I'm going to do this in Photoshop. I'm going to enhance it all in Photoshop. And I'm going to fast forward it. I'm going to fast forward it. But if you have any questions, please let me know. Leave it in the comment. So yeah, the first I'm going to do is Photoshop. And then I'm going to create like a bunch of layers. Like each arm, I'm going to create some layer. And you'll see what I'm doing. You'll see why I'm doing it. And then I'm going to take all those layers, all those images, and I'm going to slap them together into Premiere. Technically, you can create a GIF from Photoshop. But you just you can't really do a video. I mean, it, you can, but it's just not, it's not as good as Premiere, okay? Leave me alone. Premiere is so much better. I'm gonna do it in Premiere. I'm gonna take all the files that I created in Photoshop. I'm gonna take them in Premiere, and I'm gonna explain. Like every time I stop, I'm gonna jump in. I'm gonna explain stuff. But yeah, it's gonna be a fast video. I'm gonna fast forward a lot. So here we go.
pretty much finished the digital part. I digitally remastered this. This is gonna go my art station profile. Please vi visit the link below. You'll see, you know, I'll upload it to my Deviant art. Technically, in you know, a digital remaster of a traditional painting. Yeah, you know, it's art. Give me a break. Okay, let's see. This here is the original, and here's the digital. See, I made the guy a little bigger. That way, uh, I want to make his cave wave. Now, let me go show you how I'm gonna do that. The painting is done. The painting is done. You can save this as a JPEG. I'm gonna do this so. It's saved. I'm not bothering with it. Now, what I want to do is I want to create the video, the, the GIF, the GIF, whatever. So, uh, we're going to move all the arms. We're going to move all the arms. I have all the arms right here. I'm not I'm not bothering bugging with the shadows. The shadows, I can actually merge them. The background is going to be one layer. Sky is going to be another layer. Clouds are going to be moving another layer. And then the arms are all going to be moving their layers. So, let's go to the arm. So I'm going to start making a move. So this, this arm, let's say. I want this to just wobble back and forth. So this is the original. I'm going to duplicate it. Control J. Control J. I'm going to grab the duplicate. And I'm going to just distort it. Because if I do warp, it's going to just mess it all up. If I do freeze transform... Actually, I might do free transform. I just hold hold control and just drag like this, like this maybe a little bit, a little bit like that. And then control T. Maybe, maybe uh, as it goes up, the palm goes up a little bit like that. So it's gonna start right there, and it's gonna go right here. That's a that's like a big arc, right? So let's see what happens if I move. Yeah, it's gonna start right there and go right here. So now all I gotta do is just duplicate them all. Either start from here or from there, and just make sure you know it gets to that. Okay, let's go to the other arm. I'm I'm not done. I'm gonna fast forward this. I'm just talking and see. Okay, this arm, that's the original position. Let's duplicate. Control J. I'm gonna grab Control T. So, okay, this one's gonna go like that. So, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna just do the same thing. I'm gonna fast forward this one, same thing with this arm, this arm, this one's gonna wobble a little bit. This one maybe going like up and down, you know, maybe a little bit. Okay, so we have the starting and the finishing positions of every moving up. Well, actually, no, not every moving object. I still have to do the guy's cave, but I'll do that later. So, uh, first of all, let me show you how to do their arms. And then I'll fast forward and I'll do the cape as well. Just perfect. It's gonna be one smooth movement. Look how many layers we have. Let's get this on now and connect it to this.
Okay, so now that I have all my layers, it's time to save them. And you need to save them as transparent PNGs. So, like, you need to isolate them. Isolate them and save them just like that. You, you know, you don't want to save it. You don't want to crop it on it. Because if you crop it on it, save it as a PNG, it'll still work. But then you'll have to position it on your video. You'll have to move it around. And it's a pain in the butt. And you'll see why I'm keeping this box. So I already saved them all off screen. So this is what I did. Since there are nine of them, I saved them more, you know, on their own layer together. The, the you know, sm smaller ones, you know, they had like four or five layers. So you'll see, you'll see why I'm doing this all in uh, Premiere. I'll, I'll see, I'll, you know, you can do this. And then also for effects for Premiere, I downloaded all these videos. I found them on YouTube. They're free. You can use them. You know, you can just, you can go to Pixabay. And like this, I'm gonna overlay this. I'm gonna overlay this. You'll see what I'm doing. The black brown gonna go away. I'm gonna overlay this over the sand. And what I also did is I separated the clouds in the background. The clouds, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do all that. I'm. I'm not gonna move the moving clouds. I decided not to. So I merged them in the background. And the reason I separated the background from the sky, you see, see like this. I'm gonna do moving like clouds back there, maybe like moving wind or something like that. But I don't, I don't want to touch the ground, so I, you know, the ground's gonna be its own layer, and so forth. Every hand is gonna be there, and uh, then we have the guy. I don't know why is this one black and the rest aren't. I don't know, whatever. It's just the way my PNG are displayed, and we have the guy, you know. And, and you see how he, how his cape is moving when I when I scroll. So when it goes really, really fast, it's gonna move a lot. Duh. So, okay. So without further ado, let's open up Premiere and start working there. All right, so we have this new uh, file open. <clears throat> And then we're gonna start dragging media there. I literally just read something, didn't I? Okay, first, first things first, we get the you know the square, the sky, that's the main one. Boom. And uh, it's just there, the sky. Then we're going to move the ground and boom right there then what else are we gonna do I'm not gonna do anything else for now I wanna leave all of them guys alone I wanna see what happens when I do some of the effects okay first of all let's do the sky effect and then what do we have we have a dust overlay golden dust background loop animation let's see here I'm gonna let us play so you can see who it was all design creator.com that's their YouTube channel okay so this what what do I want to do with this I might you know what let's, let's see what happens so if I do this and I'm, I might lay this like over the entire thing later. I'm gonna leave this alone for now. Let's see what else I have. Optical flares, that's for the sun. Let's see, I wanna do this. Subtle dust. Yeah, let's see what happens if I do this. Let's see if I happens if I move this video right here. And let me, uh, Turn this one off for a minute. Move that up. Okay, let's see how it looks 
if I screen it. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna just zoom in. Hey, you see something's happening. You can barely see it. So uh, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna move. I'm gonna rotate this some bitch. I'm gonna rotate this motherfucker. Rotate it all the way from there, and I'm gonna scale it until like this. Let's see what happens. I might even remove it all together, you know, it's not enough there. Yeah, you see, that's, that's not enough, like, to make an impression. So I'm just gonna remove this all together. Okay, let's drag this there. Turn off. Uh, delete this crap. Let me make sure it's selected. And I can just expand it. And uh, raise it up. And let's screen this too. Let's screen this, see what happens. You go to screen, it removes all the black. And let's see what happens. Yeah, it's like better, right? But that, like, I feel like this needs to be overlay the whole thing. Like this right here. You know what? I'm gonna just, for now, I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna move it like way, way up. Way, way up. And turn it off. Okay, let's get the flare. I'm gonna go the flare. Get the flare. Remove the volume part. Let me.
Okay, so it's not all disappearing and I want this all to disappear. So in order to do that, I'm gonna, can I control L here? I'm just trying to control L like I'm on Photoshop. Yeah, I'm sure I can adjust levels. Select the layer. And then we'll go to opacity and whatnot. Okay, so you grab the flare, then you grab level from effects, drag them down there, and you raise the black to, there we go, look at that. And then, oh no, I wouldn't need it anymore. Let's drag this layer over here. Let's see what happens when it's right here. Okay, we're gonna just do this. Boom. Like this. I'm just gonna have a little small piece. Drag it right here. And now I'm gonna position it. Let's pos I'm gonna position it right over there. There we go, boom. And then right there. And then maybe even smaller. I'm just like trying to stabilize it. I mean, I can stabilize it like that, you know. We see it's moving, it's slowly moving. I don't want it to move. So I'm gonna undo it. So I'm gonna duplicate it and reflect it back on itself. So hold Alt, click over, bam. And then this one we're gonna reverse. Reverse. No, wait a minute. can I reverse?
Okay, so yeah, the flare reflected the sun. So I'm gonna go right click. N not right here, but right here, yeah. And then speed duration and then you reverse speed. You just reverse it. So what's gonna happen is the sun's gonna move to the right and then gonna bounce back to the left. I think it happened, it just it happened so fast we didn't see it. Yeah, there we go, yeah. So what we're gonna do is now we're gonna merge them together. Nest. And then we're gonna slow these bad boys down. Speed duration by like. Oh it, it's a video, so he doesn't wanna. No, hold on a second. It's already nested. <laughs> I don't want there we go, yeah. So let's say a thousand maybe? No, it's too slow. No, it's too fast. I'm gonna slow it down to like 10%. So let's see what happens at under 10%. Why the hell did it did, did this thing to me? Let's do the screen mode. Yeah, there we go. The SAC is gonna be right there. And it's slowly moving, right? Maybe slow it down a little bit. Speed it up with me. I'm gonna have two of them there. Okay, that's okay, that's, that's good. Let's see what we can do with the sand part. And the sand part, I believe, like, you can even use it to, uh, for the clouds, maybe. I, I could have swore I saved the cloud video. But it's okay, the, the sparkles that we saved later, we'll, we'll use them later. And this dust overlay. Remove the volume, we don't need that crap. Okay, let's see here. Move it all the way there. Scale and a scale, I see. Greenness and also opacity, they slow the opacity. And let's see what happens at the very beginning. looks amazing but like I don't like the the, bur the burst at the beginning I don't like that like big burst I didn't like that like I, I like this I like it from here so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut it right here delete this part
Yeah, that's good. Slow it down by forty five percent. Maybe I should flip it sideways so we can. Yeah. See what happens if I move it all the way upside down and do that like that. You can see the quotes. Yeah, I don't like it. I like it better like this. Okay, and this portion, I'm gonna just cut off this portion. Okay, let's see here. I'm gonna transform this. Trans horizontal flip, there we go. Let's see what happens. If I put it up there too. You know what? I like just the bottom clouds. I'm gonna just delete the top shit, man. I mess around with it too much. So okay, so we so far we have the clouds. I mean the dust. We have the sun. Now let's start slapping on the arms. Actually, no, let me just do the over the the one that's all the way up there. What is it? The golden dust. Let me turn that on and see what happens. Yeah, with this one, I might have to do it upside down. Flip this wrong thing upside down.
Okay. So what I'm gonna do with this one is I'm gonna move it down behind the dust. Oh, I'm gonna move it down behind the dust. I'm gonna move it under the sand PNG. So what I'm gonna do is move this one up, move that one up, and move this one down. You see, I put the things to start under behind. So now it's like this. And I could probably lower the, the opacity on a gold dust thingy too. Like this. Yeah, there we go. That's pretty good. Okay, first things first, let me drag over the guy. And now you'll understand why what I meant when I said leave uh, the box around it, around them. So guy one three, I'm gonna drag all three of them right off the bat, right on top of the dust. Actually, no wait, dust overlay goes on top. So yeah, that's do this. Guy one, guy two, guy three, and you'll see in a minute what I mean. What I mean. You see, when I drag them over, he automatically goes in a spot because there's a box. This is why I said, make sure that you know when you save the PNG, the box is there. Now I'm gonna save him real quick. I'm gonna do this with the rest of the arms in a minute, so I'm gonna fast forward. But for now, I'm showing what I'm doing with the guy. I mean, I'm not gonna fast forward, but whatever. So I got them selected, nest. And then I'm gonna speed this motherfucker up. Let's speed him to fastest, I mean, maybe like 400, I don't know. See, I don't know, why is it showing me this? Show me the time. I forgot how to change the time thing. Okay, why is it not moving? It's moving, but it's really slow. So we need this to move fast. So we're gonna speed this bad boy up. Let me do No, that's not what I'm looking for. Yeah, that was fucking good. That was awesome. So what I'm gonna do is, I don't, I don't, you, you didn't see it yet, probably, but where is he? There he is. So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna take him, hold Alt, 
drag them over. And in this one, I'm gonna reverse the speed. Reverse speed. And I'm gonna merge them together. duplicate them and it's all gonna be one guy ah uh, now how do I exit oh, yeah there we go perfect so let's look Yeah, you see what's happening to his cape? Yeah, that's gonna be good. Okay, I like it. I like it. I like it. I love it. I want some more. Oh. There we go. Got a nest. this and DJ Khalid another one another one and another one See, the guy only did three layers, so you can only imagine with the arms how smoothly they're gonna move. The more the layers, the more smoothly it's gonna go. It's like stop animation. So, right now, we got to see we got the cape, we got the wind, and you know, I sh I'm gonna probably do a shining thing on a like you know, once in a while, a sparkle comes up, oh, yeah, you know, on, on a on a staff. I'm gonna do that. Okay. Let's start moving the arms. I'm gonna move the dust up another one. And then I'm gonna move all the layers. All my layers. All my layers in order. All the big guys. Just boom like that like that. Boom. Let me merge them. And I'm gonna speed them up to like, I don't know, 5,000. Let's see. Ooh, no, 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 that's too. 3,000. No, let's do 1,000. Just to see how it looks. Just to see how it looks. Ooh, that looks so freaking scary, doesn't it? <laughs> but it looks tight. Hold on a second. Okay, let's go back to the arm. Where's where my arms? And uh, speed duration five. Now let's do four thousand. You know what? It doesn't matter, man. Let me just duplicate them. Let me duplicate it first. There, the, if I don't reflect it, there might be like a jump. Yeah, 
it's a sudden jump, so I gotta do is. What I gotta do is. Speed duration, reverse speed. And see what happens if I do it like that. Two of them. I could have swore I made so many more. Oh, I can't see anything. This is this is one thing I hate about Premiere, man. I hate this too. So merge them. I'm going to speed this up to uh, ooh, um, 500. There we go. Let's see what happens now. too fast actually now yeah they might be moving too fast I'm gonna move slower so what we're gonna do is speed duration about full hundred maybe maybe 350 They're good enough. I'm gonna leave them there. Maybe even slower. I'm just trying to fill it up, you know, fill up the timeline. There we go. Now these three are already together. So we got the right, L, and little one, right? Oh, that's awesome. This is this is very easy, my friends.
this one's gonna be. Let's see what happens if I put it above 600. Freaking awesome, man. I love it. All right, let's see here. They're all like, you know, the ends are reflected, so it comes out as a perfect, smooth ride along. And I'm mainly concerned about the claw. <laughs> the claw. The arm on the right, this one right here, you see how it's clawing? They're all like moving and it's clawing. Yeah, it's like, come on, come on. Yeah, it's awesome. That's it. Well, not, not necessarily, I gotta do the little arm, tiny little arm on the end. And I also wanted to do a little shine rate to the crystal. I'm gonna do all that. Ooh. Alright, let's move the dust one more up and grab the last bad boys. We can move, have them all move all slowly. The little, the little one. <laughs> the little one. There's only one little one, yeah. And that one's gonna be uh, right there. Let's see where he's at. Right here, we're gonna nest him, and I say he's moving like 300, maybe. Since there's only four of them, so actually, maybe, maybe. Moving 
but it's moving slow, that's perfect. Wait a second, we'll put him 900. 900! 900, we'll duplicate him, flip him over, and reverse it. Duplicate, flip it over, and reverse it. Duplicate it. Duplicate it, flip it over, and reverse it. Merge. I mean, you can merge group, but I like to nest, alright? Because I like to. Ooh, no, no. Let's do Control Z. And let's see here. What do we have here? It looks. Oh, something jump. What, what, what was that jump? There was a jump there, though. No, that was not jump. That was just me interpreting. Yeah, there was no jump. <sighs> there we go like this. Let's see. Yeah, there was just like a little jump. There's a little jump there somewhere, huh? Something jumps. I gotta pinpoint where. I don't think it pin. I don't think it jumps. It just like you know, like randomly thing things. It doesn't jump. Let me get the tool and just clip all this unnecessary crap off. I don't like to keep this shit. That's all we have, so let's see here. Okay, so now I want to do is I want to do the final touch. I want to do a sparkle on uh, the staff. So I'm going to make my own. You know, you can PNG it, whatever. Well, I'm using a black background so I can see. And um, let's see, man. I'm just going to use a legacy brush, man. I'm not gonna do anything special. Not even a starburst. I don't like those. You know those starburst brushes, the stars that they have. Hold on a second. Let me. 
so I'm gonna get a... Uh... Yeah, I don't like those star brushes that they splatter. I don't like none of that crap. You know, like all these, I don't like that. I don't like it, man. What I like is... Where's the assorted? No, no. Let me find... Yeah! Yeah! Oh, it's right here somewhere. Crosshead. No, no. Mm, yes. I like these. Mm, I like this, but not... There we go. Kind of like that, right? Oh, actually, no, let me do render rents. Okay, and you know, this is just a PNG. This one, like, I'm just gonna save this as. Save as PNG, I'm just gonna go with Spark. No, whatever. And let's go grab the Spark, huh? Let's go. Let's see what's happening here. Let's move everything up one. Move everything up. And I'm gonna grab the spark. Okay, so we're gonna move this thing. Down. There we go. Okay, so what I'm gonna do with this, 
Where are we? Damn, I hate this so much. I hate this so much, but... It's gonna be like a... Speed duration. Like this. Oh no. Let's do this. Speed duration. Let's do three. You see how it like it does just I'm just gonna move it randomly. It's gonna randomly go off and on. Not like random, you know, I'm trying to, you know, eyeball it. Like, I'm not pretty precise, you know what I mean? So here we go, this is how it's gonna be. This is the final. And uh, this is how we started. It's, it just needs to play several times before it gets a groove. There we go. So you see we went from here to here. And the NFT is done. I'm gonna upload this to uh, OpenSea I believe the link is below. I mean, <laughs> it should be already alive by now. It should be live by now. Please, guys, please subscribe me. You know, support me any way you can. Super rare. If you guys are watching this, please uh, accept my application so I can start listing on your site. You don't want to, and uh, I guess I'll see you later.